here's how I made this video file just to bring more life, more art, more of a professional polished look to it to a website and integrated it into the flash I needed four softwares first one was Photoshop essential in your video editing to make stuff look really cool what I did was I took this character here and chopped him out I found two commas, chopped those out, threw them in here too resized them, put them on the hand then I made all the three layers, the two commas and the guy, one layer you see, they're just one layer there's a shadow down here and also there's some text sometimes nice to design your text here because you get more of a design look about it in Premiere Pro they don't give you as it doesn't give you as much options as a graphic design software for doing your text this file is saved then I open Premiere Pro and here's one I did earlier I well what I have to do first is file import uh, I look for the PSD I choose open and I can choose any of those layers the shadow the guy anything then I want to I lay them down one by one the shadow then the guy and I want the guy to go up and down so I have to change this motion over time so every time a little moment of time passes I change the position and I look at it to see if it looks realistic if it doesn't I change it I make adjustments I can move these little things around also I change the rotation slightly to give it a little sway in the shadow I change the opacity over time which means the strength of the shadow to give it a nicer um, a more lifelike look I exported the video and I was left with this on the top right here then I added some special effects I added the black and white then the brightness and contrast to give it this ghost like look I had to go along and really change the contrast over just short periods of time but fortunately you can copy and paste these keyframes so once you've done a few you can copy them and paste them which is much nicer I had to reapply the shadow because the brightness and contrast seem to take the shadow away and and that's what I was left with was I exported a high quality AVI file off this then I had to open flash import it into flash resize it and save it for the web and all these things they, they take a lot longer than it looks and you can see the text down here but I decided just to shave the text off with the special HTML and on the video editing website let me just open that I'll show you what it looks like video editingguru.com I scroll down and here it is down here a flash document that loads fast that gives the cutting edge look to the style and feel of the video editing guru website and that's how we integrate video or one of the many ways into web design or even for a commercial I'm Mark Giberelli and this has been for videoeditingguru.com